you've worked with a couple of international artists. Let me, um, you know, round it up to Nigeria. You've mm -hmm. worked with, with a couple of Nigerian yeah. artists. What's the difference between working with them and working with artists in our country? I, I see that there's no much differences, but the only difference in this differences is they believe in the business itself. But when it comes to musically, we all do the same thing. We have good producers, they have good producers, we have good artists, they have good artists, good lyrics, good song, we all do the same thing. But when it comes to the business, now let's take it, how many times will you see a Ghanaian artist going to promote himself in Nigeria? Just one or two, maybe there are some of the ages are even, okay, I think Stoma is in Nigeria now promoting I, have, I don't think I've really seen Sack doing um, media tour in Nigeria, Shata, no, when they shave, whoever, like none. But you can see Emil Ade will come here. Ice Prince coming, David will come in, Whiskey, now even staying here. Benaboy will come in, Patoranke will come in. Most of them, Umale will be here. So, so, so. so now if you, let's say, Kili Kwame Uji are there, Umale also came recently, but um, I don't think they have been there to do a media tour. But Omale was here to do a mediator. So those are the small differences. We are all we are trying to be okay in where we are. We don't really want to go out there. But you see, that is where the money comes in. Yeah, everybody is crying of ah, money, money. But the Nigeria guy will not mind. We we'll just package some money, get some people to help him out, come here. They, the Nigerians have more friends in Ghana than we Ghanaians having friends in Nigeria. So right now, if Patu is coming, ah, Gazi, I'm coming, Obi, what's up? Charlie, get me 10 interviews, it will be done. But Ghanaian artists, they won't have those friends that, ah, Omar, they come Lagos, so how, if we arrange like five radios for me, it's not like that. So those are the problems that we are facing. If we put, uh, push ourselves in other countries, they will also be inviting us for shows. How many artists do they invite from Ghana for, to Nigeria to perform? But every day when we are doing a show here, we are waiting for an international artist. And the international artist there will be a Nigerian that has to come and grace the show. When will a Ghanaian artist go and grace the show, close the show in, in Nigeria? But what do you think is chasing our Ghanaian artists out of Nigeria, personally? And I think at times to their system, they've understood something that, okay, these are our people, let's push them down, pushing outsiders. Mm -hmm. but here, and we don't do it here. Yeah. I mean, even tell the DJ, they'll say, ah, so, 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 so. Ah, then they your don't like it. The audience so, 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 so. don't like but it. But then, your man, I'm so mobile. <laughs> One day, I visited a friend in the Legon campus. So I picked them. I said, well, let's go and check something here. So one of the friends connecting phone, her phone, because there are two ladies, three guys. So we were going. So the lady, one of the ladies connected the phone. That, okay, today I want to be the DJ. And the song that was played, I said, hey, Jesus Christ. So we are playing all this one. It was playing from iTunes. So now you are paying this people. But you can play and say, oh, which song will I play in Ghana? How many songs? So I say, hey, if you can talk, oh. Because right, if you go to Apple Top 10, 100, mm. you will see Nigeria, Nigeria, mm. more Nigeria than even Ghanaians. And even the number one will not even be a Ghanaian. Mm. So it's about the business itself. We have to do the business. And I think few artists have picked it up now and they are doing their mm. best. So we are going. You know, recently to Jackie was also in Nigeria to yeah. do her collaborations and all that. And when she was there, just how the media was posting everybody. Mm -hmm. hey, yeah. Jackie's in Nigeria to do. Yeah. So I don't the day it pushed her. They wanted to know who. I went to Nigeria after that. One of them said, Ah, who is that Jackie? Come on, did they play a song for every radio? And even they would think way back, R2 Beast was doing that. And people even thought mm -hmm. R2 Beast were, were a Nigerian Nigeria. artist because. They were promoting themselves. They have some deal with some other companies yeah. there, and they were pushing them there. And Becca too. Yeah, Becca too. I think from Becca way back to, to VVIP, Forex, yeah. for way back, ah, it was crazy. Mm -hmm.